In this video, we present some features of cheminfo.org. The basic idea is that we take a empty web page and we draw some modules that may interact between them, that have access to databases, that have access to external tools, and we also move a lot of logic in the web page. We write everything in HTML5 so that it's compatible with the browser, no installation, it's open source, and we use the same for research and teaching. One example is the virtual combinatorial library, where based on a template, you can draw some groups that you allow on the core molecule, generate all the molecules, and see the result directly in the browser. Those are really some modules that interact between them, and this kind of application can be done in just a couple of days. We can still filter based on a parallel coordinate those molecules. Another application allows to search for all the molecules that are present in Wikipedia by substructure. This is updated every night. While those tools are quite interesting, we are focusing now on the possibility to store in a correct way all the chemical information in a database. For this reason, we have created a new website where we have samples for which we can make image analysis, mass analysis, similarity search, but also the electronic laboratory notebook. All the functionalities are available from the browser and the data can be published in Zenodo in just one click. Let's start by adding a new sample. After login, you just get an empty page where you can just draw the molecules. You will see that the molecular formula and molecular weight, they are calculated automatically. You may add names, boiling point, melting points, but you're also able to drag and drop an NMR spectrum and visualize the data directly online. This is a real spectrum. You can still zoom in and process it. An example of extra tools is the tool that allows fragmentation analysis. So you can superimpose your experimental spectrum and then fragment the molecule and you will see all possible fragments and compare them to the experimental spectrum. So in this case, we will see, for example, that the benzyl group is the main fragment of this molecule. You can also directly process in the browser your NMR spectrum with it automatic peak picking of your spectrum. You can zoom in the spectrum, but you will also get directly the American Chemical Society kind string for publication. So this NMR string that we normally put in experimental parts. You can predict NMR spectra. Just in one click, you will get a prediction using Spinus. It's interactive. You will see which proton corresponds to which signal. But you may also superimpose your experimental spectrum and compare the prediction and the experimental spectrum. 3D model is just one click away. You just select the molecule and you get a 3D model. You can tune it, change the shape of the atoms, but you can also measure distances with just two clicks. Another main component of this website is the electronic laboratory notebook that is especially designed for organic chemists. You can add a new reaction for which you will enter the reagents and you may search by cas number, molecular formula or UPAC name. This is connected to a reference database of over 200,000 products and the system will retrieve automatically the molecular weight, density and molecular formula. After filling all your table, you will add the quantity of one of the reagent, and then define the number of equivalent for the other reagents. All the quantities are calculated automatically. In order to draw the schema, you would just click on the little ring next uh, on each line, and the system will add the structures in the schema. You may just go over, copy one of the reagents, and then change the reagent in order to reach the final product. You may now write the procedure, but instead of having to copy all the quantities, you will just click on the small icons that allows to fill the line with the right quantity, millimoles and volumes. You also have shortcuts that you may define in order to paste directly the usual sentences. At the end of the reaction, you will add a product. 
the system will determine automatically the molecular formula, molecular weight. So you just need to enter the quantity and you get the yield.